All right, guys, Yowie Chaser. We've just seen a dirt road that sort of looks all right. Hang on, I'm just charging the phone up because it's going flat. I forgot all about it. It's on 16%. But um, as soon as I drove up here, I don't know what they are. They're like little wallaby things, little dark brown ones. Two of them went flying across the road, so... That's probably a good sign. Anyway, this is like, I'm at the top of Woodenbong. I've come out of Woodenbong and I'm up the top of the hill before you turn down to go to, um, Kyogre. So yeah, then we'll see where this goes, eh? Could be good. Could. What's up here? Looks like there's something with a rock on it. Someone's water bottle. It's probably the last guy they got in by Yowie. It's probably his water bottle. Alright, I like, I like this. This is good in here so far. Scary. Deserted. I like it. We're up high. You can see through some of the bush. Probably where Ma and Pa Kettle live. I don't know, it looks good. Try and get this battery going, guys. But anyway, this is where we're heading. This might be alright in here. Alright, we might be coming to an end. I've just seen a fence, a gate. I can see like a property or something by the looks of it. Farmer Joe's property. I'll go down these other little dirt tracks, but oh, look at them. We might be getting wet soon too. Alright. All right. So I couldn't help myself. This track looks like a little bit better. But um I don't know about the way out, but if I got wet, I wouldn't get out. I don't even have a look. I don't know what those signs are for. But this is, um, I think this will just take us to a farmer's house. I don't really think that's what's going to happen. It looks so good. It's good to find just a dirt road like this. You can just cruise along for 50k's or something. Be nice. Yeah, she looks like she's opening them up again. Yep, we're at Bellbird. Yep, there's a the house. Well, Bellbird house and a caravan and some cars. I don't think we're supposed to be here, so...
Looks like the old wrecking yard over there. Good spot they got. Might be scared living there at night, I reckon. Alright, so that was another useless dirt track to go down. Keep on looking guys, keep looking. I'm mm, just checking out the time. I'm gonna be home to watch 60 minutes. There's something on, I wanna watch, I can't remember what it was. Anyway, this is where we are. So I'm gonna go right. Let's see what's down here. Mm. Alright, so I've found another track. This one. New GT stripes on the car. So, I don't think many people have been on this one. Looks like an old house. Like, oh yeah, it looks like there's an old house there. Coming to an end. Man's nest. We can get around that. Oh, you good thing. Don't get stuck there. You think I would have learnt me less than I? Get up there. I might. But falling one of them ditches. That's the end. It's all over. Why do I do this? Alright, I've got to get out and have a look, guys. Alright. I can get through that as long as I stay high, but the back tyres, no, I caked with mud. So I'm gonna have to get out of here as well. I don't have to go forward or go back. There you go, I've got to sort it out. All right, and I'm guessing I'm going back because I can't go forward. <laughs> you just won't go. There's that much mud on the tires. Oh my god! All right, when I turn it around, I'll let you know. Oh, it looks like I'm going out backwards. Have a look at this on the tire when it turns. Hang on, where is it? Oh. I don't know if you can see that back wheel. There's, all, there's that much mud on it, the sticks have stuck to the tyre. Huh? And they're spinning with it. <laughs> Extra traction. Alright. Oh shit, it's starting to rain. Alright, I've got to go. Still going backwards. Trying to find somewhere to turn around. Everywhere I try, it just spins. I really got stuck. Alright. If it gets any heavier that rain, I'm gone. 
Right. <laughs> We're still backing out. Just got through the obstacle course. It's a bit harder here now. The ants aren't happy. I've just gone over their nest. I've still got my sticks. Oh. The thing is, what's wrong is the tyres are just caked with mud. There's just no grip. I hope I can turn around soon. There's going to be some striped new scratches on the car. Oh my god. Alright, no more dirt roads. I said that last one. Alright, so we got a bit lucky. It was a, it's like a driveway to a, an old house here. I was able to get around into that. Have a look at the tyres. Oh yeah. I'm going special today. I got one shoe, one foot. <laughs> and my foot, I don't know, something's wrong with my toes. Oh, I'm just going to have a look at this. Starting to get heavier that rain. Oh, yeah, that would have been the front steps or the back. Oh, yeah, there's the driver. Oh, foot pass. It's all happening. So, our mate's on his way home from work. Comes up the stairs. Hi, honey, I'm home. It's good to see you did the housework. <laughs> what an idiot. <laughs> oh. I wonder what happened to it. She's double brick, she's solid. <laughs> She's um she's like a tree house now. What's going on over here? Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, oh falling over! Oh then a bit of brick like that, my leg went straight into that. Oh shit. <laughs> oh honey, I've been to the pub, I've had too much to drink. Oh that hurt. Don't trust tree branches to lean on because they snap. Stop laughing. It wasn't funny. It hurt. <laughs> oh my god, I'm hopeless. That really did hurt. All right, so what would you say? That is the bench, laundry, or something. When I fell, me, my knee went into that, um, the edge of that brick right on the pointy bit. That did hurt. Oh, right, this would have been the shed, I reckon. It's weird, eh? Well, it's just demolished, or well, whatever's happened, right? I just finished laughing. <laughs> oh no. Unreal. I'll bet I have a good lump there later.
So mud rubby. Let's see below it. Holden. Holden block. See Holden still going. Probably been out in the bush here for 50 years, still in one piece, it's still good. There's that rain that's coming. I'll get out of here, but from where I am now, it's like gravel the road, so I'm not worried. Alright. I hope he's had a good laugh. That's what happens when you wear one thong and one shoe, see? I only, I only took the shoe off before because my toe was sore. Anyway. We've got other, other things to worry about now. This would have been a mad little place to live, I reckon. Middle of nowhere. Yowie country. Oh, that is. Hello, box. Alright. Well, that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed that little fall. See you on the next one.